<laughs> that was the perfect timing. The music just got really quiet. Also, Trey, I don't, I don't know why the oh, they're drinking up, go up. But thank you for the follow. <laughs> And hi Deb, how's it going? I love those Pokemon emotes. Yes, we're gonna get an Empoleon soon, I hope. Um, okay, I'm just gonna set up something. I have had COVID all week and I was finally feeling so much better last night. But today I still feel like my lungs are tired. <laughs> so if I'm a little out of breath, that's, that's why. All right. I think, I hope my sound alerts work. Every time I have to refresh it, every stream. So we'll see if it works today. And today we're getting back into the water type only playthrough. I thought I'd wear my crab shirt <laughs> as a uh, bit of excitement for a water type only. Now, did I, no, I haven't, I haven't uh, beat this gym yet. So we're at the water type gym. I don't think I've talked to everyone in town though, so let's just pop in everyone's house. <laughs> Gotta use your COVID powers to compel Krishna to bring you tea. He's made me tea before, but he doesn't do it the way I want it. Like, it's gotta be perfect. Gotta put in the right amount of sugar, the right amount of milk, and depends on what tea I'm having. If I have like herbal tea, I don't want milk, I don't want sugar. It's a whole thing. It's just easier if I make it myself. But I might take a break, like, maybe an hour through. <laughs> the Nyan cat. Is it working? It's so long. <laughs> did that work for you guys? I hope it did. Hi, Pack. <laughs> um, but yeah, I might make some tea halfway through stream. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. How's it going, Pack? In the Great Marsh, they use quick trams on rails for trans tra 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 transportation. <laughs> I can't talk. They prevent damage to the Great Marsh's ecosystem. It did work. Okay, good. You know what I think it might be? Anytime I switch scenes in Streamlabs, I think it resets my sound alerts and it makes it not work and then I have to reset it again. Because sometimes when I switch scenes when the cats are here then maybe that's why i think i figured it out <laughs> i hope so the trainers deliberately prevent their pokemon from evolving why would you do that though oh she's so cute with her parasol you're just like a totally impatient boy i met earlier just like you who's very close with this pokemon oh okay very nice This is so annoying. What is it? Oh, some kid with only three gym badges. Little twerps like you should know to stay out of Team Galactic's way. Now this package from Veilstone. Where should I set it off to? Yeah, this is going to be a smashing job for Team Galactic. What is this? Oh, the Great Marsh. Okay, let's go in. I don't remember this. It's going well. Just a bit stressed because uni starts in two weeks. <sighs> Did not get any message from the uni dorms and payments are open in three days. Oh my. <laughs> Yeah, that is, that is not fun. Are you excited though? I know it's stressful, but are you at least a little excited to start university? When you're walking on the bog, you sometimes sink right in. I get so flustered trying to get out. I have no luck catching anything. Use a pair of binoculars to look out over the Great Marsh. You can see what kinds of Pokemon can be caught from where they are. Do you have to pay? All right, I want to just try this once. Is that it? Can I move? I don't know. That was it. Ah. Oh. Okay. Ah. Uh, is that a water type? Whooper. Ooh. Very excited. I'm just stressed because of the dorm situation. Yeah, like, usually... I don't know if it's the same where you are, but I feel like you have to fill out a questionnaire for your roommate like to find someone who might like fit your personality but I'm not sure also I never stayed in a dorm because I was not willing to pay that much so I lived off campus when I went to school <sighs> I 
Oh my goodness. Here I thought I was over COVID, but I'm still a little stuffy. But at least I'm not as exhausted as I was the last couple days. Oh my goodness. So the Great Marsh um, sounds like every day there's new Pokemon. Should I bother going in here? Oh, it's a safari. Okay, let me just look up what I can get. Also, is Wooper a good Pokemon? Um, it is water and ground. Mm. Is Quagsire any good? Water and ground does sound good. I don't know if I want one. I would like a shiny one. <laughs> uh, let's see. Can do mud bomb. Has, can learn some ice moves. Muddy water. Earthquake. Earthquake might be nice. Hmm. I always catch one and then use it later if I feel like it. Although Gastrodon is also ground in water. Okay, hmm. let's just go in. All you can catch. Oh, I remember this now. Okay, this is fun. We'll do this. But we can only catch water types. Out in the sticks. To and fro, we go, we're quick. If you're thinking about going deep into the marsh, I recommend you take the Great Marsh Quick Trams. Oh, it's a little train. Oh, that's cute. Nice. Got some TMs. Defog. Is it a... Is it something I can use on this? Oh, maybe not. Oh, how do I put this away? some water over there. Can I fish here? All oh, right, and you don't fight them. You just catch them. Paralyze heal. Can I fish? I sure can. My rod's not that great. <laughs> Let me see. Um, I get a whisk cash, Barbaroach, Carvana. Ah, I do not have a super rod. Hmm. I don't know. Nah. Can't really get anything too great here. Also, my time on my switch is off. It says it's the evening. <laughs> I was playing a lot of Animal Crossing the past few days trying to catch beetles. And I was not not doing so well. Aw, <laughs> I know Badoo.
you're walking on boggy parts, sometimes you get sucked down. Getting free of the bog takes time, which is a luxury in a safari game. Oh, gold duck. Wait a minute. My side deck is definitely. Okay, you know what? We'll just catch it. My side deck is definitely higher level than the gold duck. So I feel like I need a water stone to evolve it. I don't remember if they can run away. I think they can, yeah. You can bait it with some berries. Oh, you just... Oh, okay. I thought I had these berries. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yay, Pokeball. Oh, this is the area I looked at with binoculars. <gasps> Quagsire. Let's try to catch it. Just cut. It's gonna run. Oh. Come on. Get in the Pokeball. No! They don't like bait. <laughs> Am I supposed to kick mud at it? Oh my gosh, a Meryl. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> and the next gym is gonna be such a pain. <laughs> Just water against water the entire time. my team though. It's a water and fairy. Okay. We'll see. Is this the area I fall into? Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> That's so cute. I like this safari. Ah, oh, here's a whooper. I can't wait for the new game. Because the whooper is, looks like a pooper. <laughs> also, is the music a bit too loud? Turn it down a little bit. flying types. We want water types. I'm so sorry if I'm all sniffly. but we don't need it. <laughs> uh, I might try going to another area. I just want to see what the other areas look like. Oh, I gotta go around. Let's go to area... Oh, there's more! Ooh. Oh. So, this is area 6. Okay, let's go to area one. Uh -huh. 
Go upstairs to the observatory before you start. Check the marsh with the binoculars to see where the Pokemon you want happen to be. That's how you win. Hi, Bagel. Bagel's been loving the basket over here recently. But I don't know if he'll sit in it today. We'll have to see. I might just hide under the bed. <laughs> okay, another whooper. <gasps> we got it! I hope I don't need a water stone to- oh no, it evolves at level 20. I was looking that up. <clears throat> okay. Definitely- oh! Hi, Bagel! He loves the basket. Thanks for being near his mama. No, I didn't know there's a time limit. That's okay. I what was the other one I would have ca caught is a Golduck, so I think I'm fine. Can you guys see Bagel? Okay, can't see too much of him. Let's move this camera a little, because we all know Bagel's the real attraction here. Oh, one day I'll get a better camera. <laughs> How's that? My water bottle is here. <laughs> there we go. There's Bagel. Okay. Yeah, my Psyduck could be a Golduck. Hmm. I'm not really sold on keeping this Pokemon in my team. Oh, but it does have some normal attacks, which might be nice. We'll keep it for now. Um, they're all fully healed. We could just go ahead and try to defeat some gym people. <coughs> okay. I haven't done this gym in such a long time. it's not too hard. <laughs> oh, Psyduck has a fighting attack. Oh, that'd be a lot more effective. <laughs> we'll, we'll use Headbutt. won't be that hard. <laughs> you know what? I'm tempted to actually add that Meryl to my team. Just because it's so cute. It's maybe instead of Goldeen? What is Goldeen doing for me? Okay, let me see. Um, how do I check my... I'm gonna check my box. It's not Pokedex, is it? No. Bag? Or do I have to go to the Pokemon Center? Strange. Hmm. Okay, I'll come back.
Wait, what? Do I have to do this one? Where? Oh, here they are. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna swap out gold bean. Mm, do we want whooper? Hmm. I'll just keep marrow for now. Let's see, what does marrow have? Okay, we got play rough, aqua tail, bounce, and slam. fight everybody. Gotta get the XP. This gym might actually be kind of easy because everyone's going to use water type moves on me. And it's not going to be effective. And I'm just going to use other types of moves and it'll just be effective. So I think we'll be fine. Um, let's fight this guy. Poor Bagel, he threw up today. I think it was him. Sometimes he eats too fast and then he throws up. That's so sad. Okay, good. Psychic is effective. Nice. That's another Pokemon I don't have yet, is Wingle. I don't think I really want one though. It's not that strong. And then Gyarados, I think, can learn flying attacks too. Oh, <gasps> Yay! I don't need a Water Stone. Don't know why I thought I needed one. Yes! A Golduck! Are we gonna learn any more moves? Golduck. Oh, we're back here. Okay. Uh, fight you. <laughs> Azura. Oh, so cute. We're just gonna keep using Zenhead, but.
at the door. Let me just check. Oh, it's just a package. I ordered more cat food. <laughs> Let me ask Christian to get it. Switch to Gyarados. Just because I want to see if the dark moves are effective too. This ship has so many trainers. <laughs> the first couple just have like two. I guess that's not true. The first one has two, the second one has four, and then it increases as it goes. Okay, perfect. So we can use crunch and bite. Plenty of options. Oh, Gyarados is so strong. Gyarados is sleepy? Excuse me? Gyarados gonna fall asleep on me? Oh, another Gyarados. We intimidate each other. <laughs> oh, I didn't intimidate it. Interesting. My speed. Oh. Nice. Almost got it with this bite. Leveling up. Um, what does Offering do? Regain some HP. Stay rough. Uh, I'm not gonna learn Offering. Yes. Nice. Oh, that was quick. <laughs> Very quick. Azumarill's cute. Okay, is this the final one? Oh, oh, we need to do one more. I'm gonna try that. Oh, I see. I see. <laughs> have to hit the yellow one? No. It was... No. What? What? <laughs> 
I'm so confused. So green goes up, yellow goes down. So wait, if I hit yellow, it goes down. And then I can go, no. Oh, I can't go here, okay. <laughs> that took me too long. Now we fight this guy. Then maybe we get to the gym leader. So cute. One shot, nice. There we go. Wingle, we are I'm gonna kill Wingo easy. Another shellos? Oh, it's the blue one. The blue one is so much cuter. Hi, Darkly. How's it going? Also. Say hi to Bagel and possibly Cece, although she looks like she's up to something. Yeah, you. Come here. Come here. Here we go. <laughs> Come here, Cece. Come here. Cece did the craziest thing yesterday. She opened. You, you can't really see. There's a dresser. Not a dresser. A bedside like dresser uh, by the bed and she just put her paws on the handle and just pulled it open like a human I don't know how she got so smart I should really post the video okay um, I'm gonna go and just quickly heal my Pokemon they're not they don't have any HP down they just need the hit points or the attack points or the I don't want to say it, but the PP. CC, she's doing it again. Well, it's okay. I emptied the drawer, so if she does open it, it's fine. I just don't want her to pee in there. Because she likes to pee in places that are not where she's supposed to pee. Can you guys see it? There, you can kind of see her. She got it open a little. And then she's just gonna investigate inside. <laughs> she's such a weirdo. Oh my gosh. And then Bagel's like, what are you doing? <laughs> she's just going inside. I'm just worried she'll think that's her litter box. I don't know. Is she searching for snacks? The snacks are in my desk drawer, not in there. I had a box in there and she was trying to bite it yesterday, so that's out. Uh, okay. Let's go push all the buttons. I hope I'm doing the right thing. Yes, this seems to be right. Okay. Then we go down. Then... Wait. I go... No, I need to move it down. Oh, she got the other one open. Okay, the other drawer has a bunch of stuff in it, so just... Let me close that. <laughs> C 
CC's so bad. I don't know how she got that one open. It's so full of stuff. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> she's she's gone. Man, I need child locks for stuff. For the cats. It's ridiculous. Okay, let's try to beat this gym leader. What an outfit. Cha uh, crash or wake. Welcome, I don't get challenged very often. The glory you are now beholding is the Pastoria gym leader. That's right, I'm Crash or wake. My Pokemon were toughened by, uh, up by stormy white waters. They'll take everything you can throw at them and then pull you under. Victory will be ours. Come on, let's get it done. I think victory will be mine, but uh, love the confidence. I don't remember what Pokemon he has. Gyarados, okay. Okay. When I was younger, my grandma would tie a string between two cabinets so we wouldn't be able to open them, and it worked. Oh, I don't know if it would work on the cats. They would eat the string. <laughs> they would chew it until it broke. <laughs> Cece would just grab the scissors and cut it. <laughs> um, okay, I am uh, like super over leveled. <laughs> I'm gonna be fine. I was a bit worried, but no, I'm gonna be fine. A super potion. I wonder if maybe Psyduck would be uh, more effective with the psychic attack, but this'll do. Okay. Oh, Azumarill is so much of a lower level. Um, I don't remember. What is effective against ground? Let me look it up really quick. Uh, grass, ice, water. Okay. Honestly, I can use any Pokemon. <laughs> okay, we'll keep uh, Gyarados. Oh, perfect. Rain Dance is good for me, too. <laughs> It's actually raining here where I live and I am loving it. I spent like two hours this morning eating my breakfast outside. Oh yeah, by me. <laughs> um, I just ate my breakfast outside, watched the rain. It was so nice. How did I get burned? What just happened? <laughs> it's raining! Okay, let's just go ahead and use Golduck. Ah, it scalded me with boiling water. Got it. Okay. I'm gonna try a cross chop. Nice. Oh, so close. Oh. Lowers my speed. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna try Aqua Tail. Oh, no. <laughs> Be nice to have some rain. It's supposed to be hot this week. Oh no! I know, it's been a tough summer everywhere. Climate change is... It's been tough on us. <laughs> but yeah, I, we haven't had much rain all summer, so... Anytime it rains, I'm so happy. And I had a plant that was pretty dry and kind of dying, so I spent some time... This morning, cutting off all the dead... Uh, parts of the plant. 
and then hopefully it can like come back to life a little bit before the season's over. That's my hope, but you know it's gonna get cold soon. I'm thinking of, um, so I'm not gonna put out a Dash of Any video this week because I've had COVID. Um, but I have been thinking of some Animal Crossing recreations that I want to make and I want to do some of the soups in Animal Crossing. Uh, so I might make those soon. But I think as a, like, just to throw some content out there, um, I do want to post, I took like a nice video of us eating breakfast in Switzerland. So I might post that as a reel. I think it'll be nice. Okay, poor Goldbuck. Mm. Let's see his pr Oh, Prim Pump's not- not- uh, no. <laughs> okay, we'll use Gastrodon. Alright. Uh, Body Slam. Why don't we? That should do it. Nice. Now we got four badges. I think. That was his last Pokemon, right? Yes. Oh, that was so easy. <laughs> First try. Let's go. Now I don't remember what the other gyms are. Oh my gosh. Don't look at my dirty badges. <laughs> The Fen Badge. We get some stickers, a TM. Brian. Yeah, Brian was nice. Okay. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I don't remember what to do next. I have a feeling we're gonna see uh, our friend when I come out of the gym. Okay, I guess not. Yeah, I don't remember what I'm supposed to do next. I know the Psyduck were in the way of a certain place. It says try exploring Pastoria City. I can talk to them. Oh, I didn't talk to her. Visiting because I want to see the Great Marsh. A scarf. It's not good either. Just so so. Feed it some poffins. I, I can't. Gym leader will use defog for us if we ever need it in the city. Oh, uh -huh. cool. Name a Pokemon. Uh, Gastrodon? That's the one I'm naming because it's the first one I saw on my screen. <laughs> I'm curious, what is your crafting project? I'm glad to hear you're not a bot. <laughs> I knew your Pokemon needs to want to move, come back. Oh, I remember this guy. Okay, we already talked to him. And I believe I already tried fishing there. Okay. I'm 
might have already talked to these people too. Okay. I think I already talked to you. And you. Okay. Make bags, hat, charms, etc. Pokemon theme, but I'll jump on to the next one now. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for popping by. <laughs> that sounds really cool. I was thinking about doing some more, um, not some more, I was thinking of doing some art. I have a paint by number kit and I never finished it. And, oh, there's a little bit of puddle here. Um, I realized that I have a table, like a breakfast in bed kind of table, and the table can lift up and you can have it like at an angle. The reason I stopped doing my paint by number is because it was hurting my back just like um like looking down at the counter and the paint by numbers are really detailed. So I want to use that table so I can just sit in bed and, and paint. I think that'd be fun. I do want to get that finished. Um so I explored Pastoria City. I'm not really sure where I'm supposed to go next. Um, oh, isn't Hard Home City the next gym? I feel like it is. Okay, well, I might just explore this area then. See if there's some Pokemon I can get. Before I fight anyone, maybe I'll see if Azumaro can do some fighting. Okay. Oh, is this more mud? Tis. Are there are people in the mud. Okay. Oh, you guys can't see because of my webcam, but there are people in the mud. <laughs> Please don't use electric tacks. Don't use electric attacks, please. Maybe I should have stocked up on some potions. Just so I don't have to keep going back to the Pokemon Center. Use Play Rough again. I'm also... I can't remember the next gym. What type it is. Me fairy? Ghost? Or psychic? I have no idea. I don't remember. Okay, let's go back, heal up, and then I'll grab some potions. What is that statue over there? <laughs> Alright, let's buy some super potions. Oh, not one. No! At like 15. Get some revives. Not one. Oh my gosh. Oh, they're expensive. Oh my word. I need to stop pushing A so fast. 
There we go. What is this? A wood carving of a crow cook. Looks like it's seeping poison. What the heck? Hi, Hannah. How are you? How are you and the kiddos? Okay, let's head back here. Uh, actually, where is this taking me? It's just taking me back to Heart Home, which I'm okay with. I am headed there anyways. Oh my gosh, two hours is too long. Hopefully it was a meeting where you just had to listen, but if it's one where you had to talk for two hours, I'm so sorry. I used to love meetings where I just have to listen at work. You muted yourself to decided to ignore them? Oh my gosh. That's the right attitude. <laughs> that was super effective. <laughs> I've just noticed the mustache on Cricketune. This is a full body mud pack. If it weren't, I would be squirming and struggling to get out. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> this is so cute. Oh, okay. Oh no. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, didn't think I would have to fight her, but yes, we do. Me in class and I zone out. It's a large group of people so I can hide under the radar. There you go. That's not too bad. I remember one time I zoned out in a meeting. And I, I was like, they're just talking about like coding and stuff. I don't need to know what's going on. And then someone was like, Andy, are you okay to do that? And I wasn't paying attention. And instead of asking to repeat, because I didn't want to admit I didn't hear it, I just was like, yep, yeah, that's fine. And I still, like, have no idea what I agreed to. And I was like, maybe they'll follow up with me after. And I don't know. Hopefully I, I didn't make a grave mistake. But I don't work there anymore, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> yes, now I work for Christian. Yeah, I was, um, I've been talking to a lot of agents trying to get sponsorships for Christian. And this one agent, we agreed on a 45 second, uh, integration for, uh, you know, for something. And we agreed on a price and they're like, okay, they pitched it to the client. And the client was like, we want to do 60 seconds, like 60 to 90 seconds. And then the agent was just like, yeah, like they, they told me, they didn't even say is 60 to 90 seconds okay. They were just like, yep, they agreed to 60 to 90 seconds for that price. And I was like, no, no, if you want that time, you have to increase your price or you have to decrease the time. Like you, you can't, we agreed on 45, you can't up it to 60. And then, um, I I told her that like I was very nice, very professional. And then she said, "Unfortunately, the client has already agreed to this, so we can't change it." And I was like, "If you can change it, we'll do 45 seconds or we'll do 60 to 90 seconds for a higher rate. If you can't do this, we're like Christians not going to accept your sponsorship." So, that was fun. Oh. What? What the heck? Where did that come from? Oh my god. Is that from that room? Well, that's fun. 
It was just a random cable that Bagel was playing with. Huh? Can I see it? Like the the other end. What's that? Let's see. I want to see the other side. I have no idea what that's for. <laughs> My PC is still running though. <laughs> well, hopefully it's not your PC. No. Okay. Jeez. Gaslight gatekeep crow boss. <laughs> oh, I'm trying my best. I mean, it's easy to just um, be more direct in email, I find. If I had to say it in person, I don't know. Maybe I, I'd probably be nicer in person or I'd be really mean. Because, like, if you're paying for an advertisement on, like, a radio station or on TV and you want to have a longer ad you have to pay more like it just it makes sense and the fact that she had kept saying 45 45 45 and then all of a sudden was like yep they agreed to 60 to 90 and i'm like what the heck but luckily christian doesn't really care about income from uh from sponsorships because he makes enough on his own so this is just like extra stuff uh, but yeah, I was talking to Christian because there was a random cable on the ground that Bega was chewing on. It's not from my room. It's not from his room. We have no idea where he found it. <gasps> oh! I think maybe he pulled it out of the air hockey table. Because he, oh, I spelled table wrong. <laughs> he has been known to chew on those cables. Yeah, it sucks that they try to take advantage. It does suck. And I almost didn't really notice, or like I didn't think it was that. Um, I didn't think it was that important. Forty-five seconds to sixty seconds, but apparently. It is. <laughs> so. Um, okay, I'm running out of attacks. But yeah, Christian was like, no, no, no. Okay. Another barbroach. Barb. Barboach. Oh my gosh! Uh, oh, hi, Taka! Can I call you Taka? <laughs> Thank you for the raid. It was six. Six what? <laughs> so yes, let me give you a little shout out. What were you up to today? Were you also playing some Pokemon? We're back to playing our... Um... Okay, viewers, that's what I thought. <laughs> Hey, it happens. Um, yeah, we're back to playing our water type only. My cats are being suspicious. Um, oh, Apex! You had to do 10 push ups. Oh my gosh, how many push ups did you end up doing? Oh, Christian said the bagel probably found that cable in his office, so not my fault. Oh my gosh, 200. Oh no. Yeah, I don't play Apex. I played it once, but I have been playing Valorant. <laughs> I suck at shooting too. It is difficult. Apex too, there's so much detail, there's so much going on that I don't think I could ever get a kill. And the map is so big. You'll never play Apex again. Me neither. I, I'm not a fan. It's it's too high level for me. High skill. <laughs> but I like Valorant because it's pretty easy. I'm starting to remember all the maps now. And I like all the agents' abilities. I like it. No one wants to watch me scream at randoms. Oh, don't scream at them. If there's anything I learned, 
is that... Oh, I can't use that on Shellos. Jeez. Um, being nice to people in those games is a good thing. Because when people are mean, just everyone has a bad time. Oh my gosh. There we go. No, don't scream at them. Oh. Oh, yeah. I know, that is, that is tough. So yeah, I had this like a similar thing when I like I'm still learning and I was trying to um I was trying to do a bit of ranked cuz I'm a low rank in Valorant, right? I don't care if I do bad. But apparently these other low rankers were seeing me make some mistakes and they're like getting mad at me, telling the rest of the team that I should have done something and I was like, "I'm learning. I'm sorry." <laughs> So then I did some more unranked um, for practice. We found three shinies! Ooh, which ones? Is this in your uh, shiny only playthrough? Oh nice! Thought that wasn't going to do that much damage. Tell me of their IP. I cannot. I cannot be mean to people. I just can't. Two Geo Rocks and one Bronzer. Geo Rock? What is that? Like a Geo Dude? <laughs> uh, Barbara Shrieky. Put him on week where I shiny him all day, every day. Oh my gosh! I would go crazy. I would need therapy after that. Oh, quick claw. <laughs> this is why I stay away from multiplayer shooters. Would not rather not deal with the headache. Yeah, the nice thing though is that you can mute, mute people. So if someone's just starting to get on my nerves, I'm like, oh, I can just mute them. Um, and if they say stuff in text chat, I don't really care. But I also had to mute some kid who was on my team because they were just so annoying. But uh, yeah. Very happy that I can mute. <laughs> what Geo Rock? Geo did second evolution, isn't it? Graveler. I know white Pokemon, right? Do I? Yeah, Graveler. Now I've, I'm doubting myself. Yeah, Graveler and then Golem. What is Georock? Oh, German name. I see, okay. <laughs> I was like, what? What are you telling me? So is it Graveler in German? Does it translate to Georock? It has a completely different name. Oh, don't cry! Oh gosh. Uh, we're gonna keep Pokemon. Let's use Brian again. Yes, pizza and a therapist sounds great. <laughs> you go cry. What are you doing, cats? Oh my gosh. I can go for some pizza. I was so happy yesterday because I've had COVID all week. But yesterday I technically didn't have to isolate anymore because I'm not contagious. But I still had symptoms so I was like, I'm just going to stay home. And then my boyfriend tested 
negative. He has had no symptoms at all. So he went and he got groceries and I actually cooked a solid meal yesterday. I was so excited. I was a little tired of eating pizza all day every day. Although it's not a bad way to live. We had a lot of pizza, a lot of takeout. Awesome patrol. Even at night it's safe around here. Uh, I need to change my switch time. If I do that, will it affect anything? I was playing too much Animal Crossing. <laughs> Trying to find those beetles. There we go. Evolution line in German is Kleinstein? Geo Rock. Geo Watts. Oh. What was his secret? This is the second time he tested negative when you tested positive. Apparently, um, playing video games all day and eating garbage is good for your health, so... I think I've always just had a bad immune system. Anytime there's a cold or something going around, I always get it. But, I mean, I have no idea how he hasn't gotten it. Maybe he has gotten it, but it just hasn't hit him as hard as it hit me, and he has no symptoms, but I don't know, he keeps testing negative. I don't know. I don't know, because when I, when I took a test a few days ago, it was positive immediately. I didn't even have to wait the 15 minutes. And we waited the full 15 minutes for his, and it was nothing. Uh. My other kiddo wants to send emotes? Go for it. I should really get some more. I, I keep saying that. I think I have some slots, but I'm not, not sure. What I also need to do is get my follower emotes put onto my Discord. Because I really like the Bagel High. And the... Oh, which one is a follower emote too? Oh, the hype one. That's a follower emote. Yeah, I should really get more. <laughs> I, I need to... Need to prioritize that. Um, let's use Metal Claw. Oh, it is not strong. We're not gonna use that. We'll just keep doing Brian. Uh, I'm also getting so hungry. I'm gonna eat some leftovers from last night for lunch today. I I made my um Oh bear! <laughs> I love it. I love the the varsity and the Toby emotes together. <laughs> Yeah, I made my um, my plant-based pasta, the one I made a YouTube video on, where I put lentils in the uh, sauce, but instead of a red pepper sauce, oops, I don't want to do that, nope, uh, instead of red peppers, I put peppers and tomatoes and onion and garlic in the sauce. Like I roasted them and then I blended them up with the cooked lentils, uh, and it was so good. Oh, that's so cute! Is that Andy Duga's stream? Oh, I feel like a celebrity. <laughs> I feel honored. They probably like um, my stream better than Christian's stream, I hope. <laughs> I say a lot nicer things on mine. And I play a lot more wholesome games. Another print club? What? Okay, I'll do the same thing. Oh, 
Block and Zen Headbutt again. Yesterday, my nose was running so much. I think my body was just like getting all the gunk out of my sinuses and all that. That I actually wanted to stream, but I was like, I can't. My nose is a faucet. <laughs> but I thought I was all better today. And I still, I still got a little bit. A little bit of symptoms. I think I just need a good cup of tea. And maybe a nice warm shower tonight. Because I took a nice shower yesterday and it just cleared everything up. It was so nice. Can I go get the berries? Oh, I can't. Where am I? Oops. Alright, I'm getting closer. My mansion, trophy garden. Cece was wrong. She's crying. Why are you crying, girl? Come here. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Sometimes when Cece's talkative, if I say anything back, she'll meow. So I just keep going. Oh, don't open the cupboard. Don't do it. Come here. Come up here. Come say hi. Come on. That's a good girl. <gasps> it's a good girl. Don't open the cupboards like a human. You are a cat. Okay? You don't need to put things away. I know, you want to. <laughs> no, I see, see. She keeps looking at the, the drawers. Hi. Oh. <laughs> I know her meow is so loud. Hi, Cece. I'm hoping she'll just go to the basket. Hello. Hello. No. I don't want to spray her for opening the, the drawer, but... I got stuff in there. I just have a box of tissues in the top cupboard <laughs> and candles, but she will rip apart tissues like nothing. Cece, are you serious? I don't know why she decided to do it. Oh my. Wait, for... Pokemon viewings. Just between you and me, all this fish rolling can get pretty demanding. Oh, I was just gonna talk to them. These are the bougie people. Where did CC go? Oh, I see her. <laughs> Rich boy. Hi, Baker. Both cats are here now. Oh, is she going under the bed? Almost. I'm wondering if she's gonna go under the covers. Um, it's Brian again. Yep, she's under the covers. <laughs> she's so silly. What silly cats I have. I just- I'm scared she's gonna pee under there one day. Or she's gonna attack the covers. I don't know what has gotten into her head. Oh, I guess my attack missed. Like, she's unraveling the bed. Just don't be there. We all know she loves a good mattress. Oh, 
Hold on. I'm just gonna check. It is a cute kitty. They're just... They're up to no good all the time. Except for Bagel. Bagel's pretty good. Cece's got a look in her eyes. Oh, hi Shane. Thanks, you too. I'm feeling a lot better. Not 100%, but a lot better. But what is, what is she doing? Oh, Cece. Cece is gonna open these cupboards. Bagel, your bum is sticking out. <laughs> He's getting a little too big for that. Now, I don't remember what this what is in this mansion. I think there's like a back garden or something? The way out to the trophy garden. It's open for all visitors to enjoy. Wow, the Pokemon may appear. Master's house, it's his office. Uh, welcome to my opulent mansion. There's a lot for me to be proud of inside and outside of this home, but what makes me the most proud is my trophy garden in the back. Why bother traveling afar when Pokemon are attracted by my garden? You're welcome to join them and marvel at my garden. If it fits, I sit. Oh my gosh, what has she done? Aww. Oh my gosh, that's so cute! She she flipped the blanket over a bit and then dove under the, f the flipped part. Oh my word. Can you guys see that? Oh, no. She was poking her head out. Oh, Bagel has to investigate. It was really cute. I wanna see if she'll poke her head out. Oh, okay. He's just gonna <laughs> lock her in there. Oh, <laughs> these cats. Oh, okay, she's just chilling in there. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. Alright. Swagger. Oh, are they fighting? I think they're fighting. Yep. <laughs> Refrain from touching it. What is this? Okay. Master actually quite enjoys showing his prized garden to strong trainers. Aw, hi Noodle! Noodle and Bear, I love your nicknames. <laughs> uh, everything beyond this point is off limits. Okay. Oh, it's the the maids' rooms. I'm happy they have nice TVs. That's so cute. Reminds me of Downton Abbey. see Cece's butt hanging out. I'm so happy the cats have each other. Oh, I've seen people doing like a uh, shiny, what are they called? Oh, shiny hunts with the, the tracker thing in here. Okay, well let's just like at one Pokemon. Roselia? No, thank you.
Oh, Bagel's returned again to the basket. <laughs> oh my goodness, these cats. They're so entertaining. Hi, Bagel. You're cozy there, aren't you? This is so pretty. <laughs> okay. I might just use fly and go to heart home. And then I can heal up a little. Ask me every morning if you're streaming that day. Oh my gosh, that is so sweet. Oh, I wish I streamed every day. I was thinking of streaming the past two days, but I just felt so tired and so sick. Oh, I couldn't do it. So I just thought I'll focus on getting better. And I also, my throat was hurting, so I didn't want to talk too much on stream. And I played Animal Crossing in bed. And I... Oh, I thought there was a gym here. Um, I was trying to find that beetle, the giraffe stag. And I spent so long, I couldn't find it. He was licking the basket. Sounds like him. Oh, Cece's going under. Um, okay, I think I can maybe start. No, nope. can I go on this gym yet? Oh, it's definitely a ghost type. Um, it's impossible. She's not here. Come back another time. Hmm. All right, that. Okay, we're gonna go back to Pastorius. Pastoria City. Because maybe I missed something. Because... Wasn't this where the Psyduck were? I don't remember. This looks so regal right now, staring at CC, the lump in the, in the bed. I think she's uh, lacking some entertainment in her life. I need to play with her more. All right, I swear I've been to every house. This lady said, no, someone mentioned that there was someone with three gym badges. Oh, right. Okay. Uh, you were eavesdropping. I was just talking loudly to myself. If I wasn't in a hurry, I'd pulverize you with my Pokemon. But I have to get on my way to the lake ASAP, so you're lucky I'm out. Oh, and listen up. Don't you dare follow me. Okay, we gotta follow him. <laughs> Persistent pest. If our plan works, our boss's dreams come closer to tradition. Our boss's ideal world is going to be created. So I'm not going to waste my time on anybody, on a nobody like you. I'm telling you now, don't you come chasing after me. Hey, it's Christian. <laughs> I'm not always going to plow into you every time we meet. So how's it going, Annie? Buffing up your Pokemon, eh? I'll test you and your Pokemon out to see how buff and tough you are. No. I don't want to fight you. <laughs> Got four Pokemon. Okay. Oh, he is such a low level. Perfect. Bagel is like, do I get out of the basket for this? 
Oh, because she's under the bed, though. He's gonna do a sneak attack. <laughs> uh, Grotile. Oh, keyboard Pokemon. Nice, super effective. Oh, not, not enough damage, though. Ouch. Can I survive this Razor Leaf? No. No. <laughs> I have enough speed. Yes. Come <laughs> on. Fago's just watching here now. Now I can go back and sit close. Uh, Puzzle. We'll keep, uh, Zoomerill. You're back. Oh, that's Cece. Oh my gosh. These cats keep me on my toes. This was all her master plan. Confuse Bagel to steal the basket. <laughs> now Bagel's on the floor. is such a good move. Ponyta, easy. <laughs> All according to plan. You were right, Darkly. She was plotting under the bed. I just started liking Pokemon. <gasps> Which Pokemon is your favorite? Ponyta is one of my favorites. But I have so many. Oof. I feel like Ponyta is one of my favorite fire types. All right, we gotta chase this guy down. But first I gotta heal up. Because I was in the middle of chasing a bad guy, and that was not a good time to want to battle. <laughs> Bagel is not upset that he's chilling on the floor. My stomach rumbling. <laughs> I ate breakfast really early today. We needed the energy from the Valley Windworks to make this. It would take a scientific genius to make something like this. Therefore, our boss who made this is a scientific genius. Gar, you were eavesdropping. I was just thinking out loud. You're a persistent pest. I'm getting tired of running away. But I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. Oh my gosh. This man is making me run. Um, where did he go? Eevee is very cute. Oh, Eevee is such a good Pokemon. I love the game Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Just because you can have Eevee as your starter. Um, 
Where did that guy say he was going? Chase the grunt heading east of Pastora City. You're like, oh, here. Why am I running like this anyway? That new universe the boss was talking about. It's giving me goosebumps thinking about it. So we use this. You are eavesdropping. I was only talking to myself. You're persistent too. I'm pooped out from all the running, but I'm not going to battle you. So we're gonna keep running. Oh my gosh. Now we're gonna battle. You're still on my tail? The lake's within sight. You leave me no choice. My Pokemon will knock you out. Also, everyone has such cool Pokemon emotes. Oh! It's a prime thing, is it? Prime gaming. So funny. He's so funny. I think at night she sleeps in the basket in Christian's office because when I come out of my room she runs downstairs and I know she's been up there so she probably just wanted a basket. <laughs> Hi Gizmo! I'm feeling so much better. Not a hundred percent yet. I still have some like my lungs just feel tired um, and like a little bit of phlegm but we're good. We are good. I'm probably... I don't know. Oh, excuse me. I was gonna say, I'm feeling less tired as I yawn. Um, and I'm probably... Don't... Like, not gonna test positive if I were to take a swab, but... I still might. I think it's been four days since I last swabbed. Hi, Hannah with the glasses. Yes, I'm feeling so much better. Oh, I'm only- I'm just hungry right now, so I, I think I'm tired because I'm hungry. Alright, uh, they say there's an island inside the lake and that a mysterious Pokemon resides there. No one must enter the chamber of that Pokemon. Sorry to change the subject, but have you seen the group of Psyduck on Route 210? Yes, that's right, by the cafe on Route 210. You've seen that group of Psyduck huddled with their heads in their, uh, hands? Anyway, what you should do is use this medicine on the Psyduck. You're working on a Pokedex, so it sh would be worth your while. Hi, Blame! Yes. Um, I have recovered. I'm still, still not 100%, but I do feel so much better. I was, like, just kind of chilling yesterday and Sunday, I think, for the worst two days, and I was just nose dripping grossness those two days so <laughs> yes feeling a lot better today like i was doing so much this morning i already feel like i have more energy so yeah thank you all for checking in on me it's so sweet um all right cynthia goodbye are these guys okay they're just protecting the lake so now I have to go to the Psyduck. Where is 210? Oh, it's here. But yeah, our trip to, to Europe was so nice. I posted some more photos on my Dash of Annie Instagram of some of the food that we ate because I realized I hadn't finished posting those. Oops. I'm just was gonna check on my Pokemon. Okay, we're good. Um, Route 210 was north? Yeah. Uh, by the cafe. Here we go. Yes. I need medicine like that to cure my headaches. <laughs> that was my first COVID symptom. I had the worst headache. All right, Cynthia's back. You use the secret medicine I gave you. Yeah, the schnitzel. Oh my gosh, I think it was called. Oh, what was it called? Um, 
Oh my gosh. Qu uh, something like Cordon Bleu? Um, and I really wanted to try it. I'm so glad I did. It was delicious. Yeah. I'm gonna put the name in chat. That's what the first photo is. Yeah, not not Gordon. <laughs> That's what it is. Yeah, it was so, so good. But then that photo... Oh, you guys, I'm hungry. <laughs> it makes me even more hungry. Um, that photo I took, Christian and I split our meals. So he had half of the cordon blue and then I had half his pizza. But we really shouldn't have because I wanted all the cordon blue and he wanted all the pizza. <laughs> Both were really good. I want you to deliver this old charm to my grandma in Celestic Town. I know there's some rare Pokemon between here and Celestic, Celest Celestic Town, so it'd be worth your while to go. Of course! I can't say no to Cynthia. Okay, my grandma has a sort of bossy air about her. I think I'll recognize her right away. I'm sure you will. She's the elder of Celestic Town. As for the location, look on your town map. Can't miss it. I'm sure it's just like north of here. Yes. Okay. Best food you can ever have in Europe is goulash? What is that? I don't think we had that. Another thing we had was an antipasta. Antipasto. Oh, a super stew of meat and vegetables seasoned with paprika and other spices. Mm. We didn't have goulash, but we had a lot of... Um, What's it called? Bolognese? Christian ordered a lot of that when we were in Europe. And one of the photos I took was of Bolognese. Like, he had Bolognese. And I had a risotto. Both of which were amazing. And we ate it on this, like, rooftop restaurant that looked over, we were in Luzerne in Switzerland. It was so beautiful. But it was also so hot, so we're just sitting there sweating and we're so sticky. And it was a bougie restaurant, a bougie hotel restaurant, and we were not dressed for it. <laughs> we had to like climb up a hill to get there and all these rich people were judging us. But it was the best food we had on the trip. I know, Switzerland was amazing. I would go back. But it's very expensive. So if you're gonna do a cheap trip, don't go to Switzerland. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm running into so many Pokemon. It is, yeah. It's, it was just ridiculous, but it's so worth it. The views are so pretty. The food was so good. And the people are really nice there. Um, almost everyone speaks English and like French and German and Italian. Like they are not offended if you only speak English. Oh, can I use defog now? I'm so glad I got it. There we go. Oh. <laughs> oh, they flap their wings. Oh, hello. I didn't notice that person. Uh. Oh my gosh, four Pokemon? Are you serious? It's gonna be four zoo bad, isn't it? to Azumarill now so um, she can level up. I should also give Gyarados my Soothe Bell because it doesn't seem to like me. <laughs> mm, let's try 
I play Rob? Don't remember what type this Pokemon is. <gasps> Making baked Pollock for dinner? Ooh. What is that? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I have to Google everything today. I don't know what anything is. Did you? Huh? I've never heard of that before. Oh, it's a type of fish. Oh. Interesting. What is it? A mild and flaky white fish that pairs well with spices to make for a nutritious meal. That sounds really good. You guys, I'm so hungry. <laughs> I'm gonna make fish tonight too. I make a really good uh, baked salmon. And since I've been so sick, I, I wanna make something healthy for dinner. Um, so I thought salmon would be good. And then for lunch I'm gonna have my pasta I made last night with a bunch of vegetables in it um, how many vegetables I put in tomatoes I put in peppers I put in mushrooms garlic onion all the good stuff and I felt so good after eating it no I still have my smell and I still have my taste I'm so happy I didn't lose those it's also the second time I've had COVID. Um, <laughs> Chris got pizza, yeah. Well, the pizza was pretty good. We had pizza, I think, twice when we were there. One time, it was just like a rainy evening, so we got a pizza from a nearby restaurant and took it back to the hotel. Yeah, it is the most expensive in Europe, definitely. But I can see why. Kind of. <laughs> like, it's such a beautiful place that oh, um, it's kind of worth the price. And I feel like it's nice that it's not too modernized or, like, industrialized. Um, everything, like, there's so much nature preserved, which is so nice. Empoleon? Aqua Jets. Let's see. Uh, that only does 40 damage. Are you kidding me? Why do you want to learn that? No. <laughs> Went to Iceland. Ooh. It's also hella expensive. Oof. Good to know. Good to know. Almost entire Europe, except very big cities. Yeah, that are way too modernized. Yeah, I guess too, we went from. Switzerland to Germany and Germany just had so much less mountain area <laughs> so it looks very different but also like Switzerland a lot of the um, a lot of the buildings had like a lot of gardens and a lot of flowers and then some of the rooftops had the like wild flowers on them and just stuff like that kind of stood out from some of the other European countries that I've been to. But we also did stay away from the cities in uh, Switzerland, so that might also be why. Like, we didn't stay in Zurich, not at all. Netherlands are completely flat, yeah. I want to go back to uh, Amsterdam. I just love the canals. They're so pretty, and the tulips. Okay, we'll keep. Only on because we can peck this grow tile. I should have used a Zoomerol maybe. Oh, but Zoomerol is poison. Hmm. Never been insulted by something that I 100% agree with. It has one hill. Are you from the Netherlands? That's like, the part of Canada we live in, also it just has hills, we don't have any mountains. And then people hear of Canada, and then they're like... <laughs> I 
Um, I can't tell how loud an ad cat is, so I'll wait till it's done. <laughs> yeah, people hear of Canada and they think of British Columbia, and not all of Canada looks like that. <laughs> It is a large country, my goodness. I literally live in a small town in the middle of a small valley? <gasps> That's so cool. I've only ever been to West Coast Canada, which is very pretty. Yeah, it is. It's quite nice. But it's very expensive out there, my goodness. Uh oh. Might struggle with this battle. <sighs> Struggle a lot. Yeah, the east coast of Canada is also super nice. Um, it's like PEI, um, New Brunswick, Newfoundland, all of those, all those provinces. Oh no, I attacked the wrong one. No. Oh well. Oh, I'm by Golduck. <laughs> Okay, um, ancient power. Oh, it's effective against Gyarados. I'm not sure if it's effective against Raichu. No. <gasps> okay, not bad, not bad. Pokemon. But I only let Squirtle wash dishes? What? <laughs> Hi Jax. How's it going? I'm glad you didn't say anything too inappropriate. <laughs> Alright, let's use Ancient Power on Gyarados. Oh my gosh. No! Oh! Bagel's disappeared. Maybe he's under the bed. He got his spot stolen, so he's crying under the bed. Oh my gosh, this couple is destroying me. One of the places that I like the most is Croatia. Oh my gosh, yes. I'd personally say that it's even better than Italy, but it might be just me, because I hate sand. <laughs> yeah, I have never been to Croatia, but it's definitely somewhere I want to go soon. Definitely. We had- I had a couple friends go there, and all the pictures they took were so beautiful. So we want to go to Croatia and Greece, and Italy. I do like Italy. Gotta go for the food. I do not want to learn Aqua Ring. Okay. I just got 3,000 Poke coins. Oops. I need to revive all the Pokemon. Where, how far am I? I'm in the middle. Uh, okay, let's uh, heal up. Um, antidote, poisoning, yeah. Five. 
Um, what? Okay. My friend went to Greece, kept hiking. Oh, taking pictures of those the statues. Oh my gosh. I think you're gonna say the blue roofs. Uh, he also went to Egypt and a lot of men kept calling him beautiful. Food is great in Italy though. Also, Venice is so beautiful. I love Venice. It's so pretty. And the food is so good. I just wanna live in Italy. And the coffee in Italy is so good. One thing I like didn't know was a thing. Whenever I got coffee in Switzerland, they put cocoa powder. Like if I ordered a cappuccino, that's I guess that's what I ordered the most. They would always put cocoa powder on it, and it was so nice. But I didn't know that was a thing. Like they asked me one time if I wanted it, I said sure, and then the other time they just gave it to me like that. So oh no, twice they gave it to me. No, one time, one time. <laughs> I know. Italy is the best. Best coffee. How do you guys get around with the language barrier? Unless Christian brush up on his Espanol. I mean... Everyone spoke English, really. Um, are you talking about when we were in Europe? Because we didn't go to any Spanish-speaking countries, but... Um, Switzerland, like, everyone spoke English. Um, and then Germany... People spoke English, but not as well. It was a bit more difficult for s some people. But we went mostly for the, the R6 major. So there, it was all English. <laughs> I do not want Whirlpool, thank you very much. They speak Spanish only in Spain, nowhere else, right? Yes. Exactly. And in South America. <laughs> But I think the Spanish that Christian knows is the South American Spanish. Yeah, I never go to France. I don't like Paris that much. I've been to France. I have a friend who lives in the French Alps. So going there was really nice. But I, yeah. I mean, maybe it would be nice to go to like the warmer areas of French, of, of France, of French, oh my gosh. The land of his ancestors. <laughs> You know, at school, your third language you learn is either French or German. Oh. Is English the second language you learn? Like, I feel, I feel so dumb when I go to Europe because everyone knows so many languages. And then I just know nothing. I know English. That's it. Oh, I don't want my bike. Second language is Chinese. Me how? Shishini. English is second, yeah. But traveling is so expensive and we have to travel again in November for my friend's wedding. It's gonna, well, it's actually not gonna be as expensive. I found some cheaper tickets. In November is the off season, so I think we, like, I think I'll try to pay for most of it because it is my friend. And I will bring Christian along with me this time. But the the R6 stuff, like, he paid for all that, so that was nice. And I actually had such a good time at the R6 Major. Oh my goodness. I didn't even care about the teams. But when, like, the one team was doing so good, I was, like, I wasn't cheering, but I was like, oh my gosh. You pros are amazing their reflexes. Did I drain his credit card? No, 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 no. I was always looking for like the cheapest stuff on the menu and Christian is like, treat yourself. He drained his own credit card, okay? I was like, let's go here, it's cheaper. And he'd be like, we're in Europe. We have to enjoy it. <laughs> oh, you said you weren't able to attend. Maybe next year, yeah. Well, I'm pretty sure that's where I got COVID. So I wish I did wear a mask the entire time but it was a long time like one of the matches was an entire afternoon so I probably still would have gotten COVID okay it's not what dragon dance yeah rogue everyone was like going nuts for rogue 
But, I mean, if the other team did well, I still, like, clap for them, because, you know, they're all amazing. I wanted them both to win. <laughs> what is it with these sneaking kids? Share the same mentality as Christian. If I'm vacationing, I'm dropping all the dollars. Yeah, the only thing I did pay for myself, like, that was really expensive, was where we stayed. Uh, it was a city called Grindelwald. And you can take um, a gondola up the mountain, and then you take a train through another mountain, and you can look out at the highest top, uh, the highest point in Europe. Um, so I really wanted to see that, and I paid for both of our tickets, and it was definitely worth it. That was a lot of fun. But yeah, a lot of the food. Like, I was fine to just go to, like, a grocery store and get whatever. But he was like, no, no, we're gonna eat nice food. Oh, then we got pizza sometimes, which was nice. It was so funny. I got, like, a bottle of wine from the grocery store. Because it's so cheap in Europe. And I... We got a pizza the same day. And I was so tired that day. So we ate pizza. And... I just had my my wine and we didn't even talk that meal. I remember we just ate silently until we finished the food because I was very hangry and then after I finished I was like that was really good. I didn't say it I didn't speak a word to you while I ate that. <laughs> Getting random stuff from grocery stores is the best experience ever, especially sweets. Yeah, like I got a I got the biggest chocolate bar. It was like this big. Um, Cause on the flight to Switzerland, uh, Christian was sitting beside a guy who was from Switzerland. And he was like, oh, where are you going? Like, let me know if you want any like advice on what to see. And I asked him of like what food we should try. And he said the chocolate's really good in Switzerland, but not just the like expensive brands. You can just buy any chocolate bar, even the cheaper ones, and they'll be good. The the just like packaging is just cheaper. So I took his advice, I got a huge chocolate bar. And it was fantastic. And it was like two what, two francs or something? Not even two francs. When you're dead tired, you're just eating in silence, it feels so good. Yes, I'm glad you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Every time I go to a different country, the first thing I do is go to a grocery store and get the most random stuff I've never seen before. That is smart. Although most of the stuff we knew, I mean, Switzerland's not that, you know, different from Canada, but yeah. It was nice going to the store. What I'd give to go to a Japanese 7-Eleven and buy up all their snacks. That sounds so fun. That'd be a good video to make. Nice, my zoom roll is catching up. I think I can make it to the town. All kinds of chocolate are great in Switzerland. Oh, your favorite is Toblerone? I, I don't love Toblerone. I really don't. I don't know why. But they had a lot of lint chocolate too. Now I want chocolate. I also think Toblerone is like hard on my teeth. Uh, I don't know why I'm using my Empoleon for everything. I'm gonna switch to Azumarill. Yes. Although, maybe I'll switch to Golduck. I think Psychic will be effective on this. I hope I can go grocery shopping soon. I told Christian I'm gonna do another COVID test when all my symptoms are gone just to make sure I'm negative. But I really want to buy candy and snacks. 
And I want to buy some stuff to record my next Dash of Amy video. I'm thinking of making an Eggs Benedict video. I think that would be good. I love using the Prime Vandal and Valorant because the reload am animation looks like you're loading a full <laughs> bar into the gun. Does it really? Ugh. I want some cool skins in Valorant, but they're so expensive. I'm not going to pay for that. But Jax, let me know if you want to play Valorant. I will play with you. I'm Iron 3. Iron 3 and not doing too well. <laughs> um, gold Dog. Uh, Temporarily empties its mind. Forget its concerns. I don't care about that. Yeah, it's very hard chocolate. Just love that when you push on the top of the chocolate, it breaks into a small piece. Yeah, that is cool. Uh, Violet skins are so incredibly overpriced, but people still buy them, so they'll never change it. Yeah, I just wish that they had some free ones in the free battle pass. <laughs> or, I was looking at the battle pass, and I think I might buy a battle pass if there are some skins I like in it, but the one that's currently going on, I don't love the skin, so. Like, I would pay, it's like 13 bucks. For the battle pass like that's fine i'll pay for that if there's like a bunch of skins that i really like but yeah okay battle pass last season had glittery skin oh i missed out on that oh is this the granny yeah there's an odd spaceman in front of the ruins there isn't anything there but that only seemed to make him angry he's saying he will blow the town up with a bomb the nerve of it all if only I were younger, I'd punish that spaceman with my Pokemon. Are you the granny? But, but I have the, the, the something. All right, I think I'll do this um, next time because I'm so hungry. I've been streaming for two hours, so that's my my usual time. I'm just, I'm so starving. Battle passes give me PTSD from the time I had them in Siege, Apex, and Fortnite all at once. Oh my gosh. Yeah, the grind is ridiculous. The only battle pass I've ever really, like, focused on is the Fall Guys one. Ooh, excuse me. And yeah, that was, that was a bit much. <gasps> Look at the leg. She's just always like has her legs pushed out. Okay. I hate to end stream. I I want to keep playing, but I gotta I gotta not. Oh, Claire is streaming. Okay, I want to raid Claire because it's her birthday. It's her birthday stream. Go ahead and raid Claire. She's a Breath of the Wild streamer and she is amazing. So if you want, you can use the raid message. I'm gonna probably lurk in her stream all day because I love her streams. Alright, I'll see you all next time. Have a good rest of your day everybody. Bye!